yeah, this is gonna be longer than two minutes. Okay, what's up guys? What's up everybody? Um, downtown Toronto right now, super windy, super cold. My hands are frozen, my body's frozen, my face is frozen. It's even hard to like speak like without mumbling. Uh, I apologize for that, but we're at the skate park with the guys from Moment. Maddie's here and uh, they came down to show us a new prototype item that they're coming out with that is oh, super exciting. Uh, I'm legit pumped about it. So let's go introduce you to these guys. I think they're skating right now. There he is, just shredding. Let's go meet him. State your name for the record, please. My name is Caleb. Work at Moment. And you're out here, uh, I said shredding the concrete waves. Yeah, uh, Peter and uh, Maddie brought us to this like kind of sketchy skate park. I'm not that good, but my bag of five tricks might hold up here. Yeah, no, it would be great. We're testing out the new anamorphic lens, so. Oh, we're allowed to we're allowed to talk about it. I was being all cryptic. Well, if, if it comes out on Tuesday. This, this is your vlog camera. Yeah, dude, I mean. This like outdoes me. Look yeah, at this. Yeah, you know. You're vlogging on a C100 right now. <laughs> <laughs> like, okay, you guys all know, like, this is obscene enough. A 1DX with, like, dead cat, all that. A C100, look. No, you got this one hand it. So, oh, my goodness. The Sigma 18 to 35. And then it looks pretty good. <laughs> it looks absurd. It, uh, no, no, uh, no gorilla pod, but you got the good hand placement here. Oh, that is so funny. All right. All right, what is this? Tell me what this is. All right, so we got the anamorphic lens, uh, 1.33 anamorphic so, lens. Explain what that means to everybody on my channel that's like, what, uh, what's that? Gosh, that honestly is like the question of the century is what is anamorphic? Essentially what it does is it's gonna make the front of your image look m more compressed, but also achieving like a wide angle. So you see this in like Hollywood, in movies, like basically. In my B-roll that I yeah, take. <laughs> yeah, totally. Like, Oh yeah, that's such a good point. Yeah. Everyone puts black bars on their footage. That is because of anamorphic. And I don't even think a lot of people know that. Do you think people No, know I that? don't think they do. Yeah. Like, I do it like to simulate that like anamorphic look exactly. because I'm it's not like, obviously getting it with the DSLR, but Exactly. So you this, want to compress it. This gives it to you. Yeah. Straight up an actual anamorphic lens. And the flares look so good. Tell me about the flares. So the flare game is so strong with the anamorphic. Basically, that's what you want. You want it kind of bends the light horizontally. So if you know if you see movies like headlights or flashlights, especially in like Stranger Things, there's tons of flares and they're dialed. They look super good. It's just like a cinematic look. I don't know. And they're when just that they're basically this. just done from an anamorphic lens. Yeah, it's just ha it just happens naturally in lens. And I know people are like putting that in their footage now too. You're like yeah, adding yeah, a yeah. flare to the yeah, sun. Yeah, kind of like this for big cameras anam anamorphic lenses are like thousands and thousands of dollars this is affordable and goes on your phone it so. goes on your phone okay yeah. hold it up let me see let me give me get okay oh i'm so pumped for this show me like a nice crispy view Ooh. look My, like, at that frigid hands yeah it's cold here sorry <laughs> yeah. canada apologizes <laughs> look at that that is dope yeah thanks dude yeah. okay let's insert some footage of flares here from said lens you guys can see what we're talking about
cold, we're out of here. We're going to get something to eat. Okay, we're talking moment. That's what we're talking about, right? Moment lenses. Moment lenses. Now, I came home because it was too cold in the city. It was too windy. It was just like... It was just wasn't optimal vlogging conditions and I had the thought I don't have to be here and do this So I decided to come home. I think it's important to say first. They're not paying me to say any of this I don't work for a moment. They didn't ask me to say anything in these videos They didn't even ask me to make these videos. I don't even have that new lens I'm pretty sure it's a Kickstarter thing if anything I'll drop the link below because they're good guys the two dudes that are running like their social front Caleb and Niles like two super awesome individuals that care about filmmaking and photography and the process the art as much as I I do and they chose to come to Toronto to spend their time with us me Maddie Chris Jesse the dope squad if you will and I'm just really appreciative of that so I thought that like I just wanted to share this experience with you guys it's such a cool product because I mean I have moment lenses I have the macro lens the telephoto lens the super wide which is one of my favorites the other wide which is ugh, in my backpack they're great products but to see that they've actually made a lens specifically for like cinematography being an anamorphic lens I mean anamorphic lenses are so expensive and that's some high-end cinema gear right there. So to be able to just offer that to an everyday like mobile user to put the power of anamorphic lens and flares and the nice wide screen into the everyday user, I just, mm, I'm pumped on that. If you guys want to learn more about anamorphic specifically, I think Maddie's doing a video on it that should be either up today or tomorrow. If not, I'll link it below, but keep an eye out for it. I think he's going to dive into the specifics, you know, show before and after and what anamorphic actually means. I mean, I know now I was explained it like two minutes ago in this video, but if you're wanting to learn more about it because it's super fascinating, yeah, check out Maddie's video or just do some research on it. It's really cool. That's why I'm so pumped that they're offering it now. All right, I'm gonna wrap this up real quick. I just wanted to end on the note of that neon footage. Now that whole little segment, I didn't shoot that. Caleb and Niles shot all that stuff, but I wanted to include it because it looked so good. And it kind of just proves a point that I really, really like, which is like good light, good location, some good props, and someone that knows how to use a camera, even if that's just a mobile phone, you can get incredible looking, incredibly cinematic looking footage. Like that stuff looked great. And it was all done on a device that sits in your pocket. So to me, it just, it's proof of concept, right? But to have this power in your pocket, exciting times, folks, exciting times. Caleb Niles, it was a pleasure meeting you guys. So dope hanging out, thanks for including me. And you guys at home watching, thank you so much for watching this video. Check out all the links below if you wanna further dive into the anamorphic world, if you wanna check out their lens on Kickstarter, any of that, if you just wanna say hi, hit that like button if you like this video, smash it, that's something that you're into, 2018 style. Subscribe if you aren't already, and, and I will see you guys later in the week. Peace.